Independence Day is a time for celebration for many Americans. But for those suffering from PTSD, it's difficult to be around the loud noises from fireworks. Local 5's Danielle Zukowski spoke with a local veteran about how this holiday is different for him than for most. But there are some that sound so familiar, so much like a mortar going off, that I've had to dive under the kitchen table at times. It just turns the clock back 55 years and puts me there, 50 years, and puts me back in Vietnam. Wade says his PTSD is so bad that he designed his basement to be his area to get away from it all for days at a time. The feeling is so intense at times that I can, I can smell the, the foliage and the, and the ground and the rotting stuff and it just brings back a, a very, very vivid memory. PTSD usually involves kind of improper storage of adversive memories or feeling sensations in the brain and, the, and, that, and those memories and sensations can sometimes be triggered in our environment such as shooting off fireworks. The VA gives local service providers guidance on dealing with fireworks for veterans. A, a really good strategy is the idea of coping ahead, right? Um, maybe doing some self-talk, maybe um, you know, scoping out the environment, even having some of that self-talk, like telling themselves, you know, I understand I may react or may be triggered by these fireworks, but also telling themselves that I can handle this. I don't want to interfere with what they're doing. I just I want them to have fun, but I want them to be having fun responsibly. In Appleton, Danielle Zolkowski, Local 5 News. Thanks, Danielle. And we have a link to the Wisconsin Veterans Village website on our website, wearegreenbay.com, for anybody in need of their services.